What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. This is the Third Person Podcast. My name is Chris. That's Mike. What's up? Guys, we're back into the Badlands. Well, almost anyway. Uh, <laughs> we've got a little video here for you. There's been a lot of images coming out. There's been a new trailer recently. And, you know, watching, you know, looking at the trailer, looking at all these images, we're getting new characters, we're getting new team ups, we're getting new characters teaming up with old characters, vice versa. We're finding out where Sunny is, all this stuff. And, yeah. and, uh, and to me, you know, we're getting to see Azra. We're getting to see this this dark power. What's the name of the power? Do we know the name of the power? I think they're just really called just like the gift. The right? gift, right? Yeah. So we're seeing the monks had the gift. We're seeing the people from Azra have the gift. The people from Azra have the same kind of colors as the monks in a way. So are they people from Azra? So we got a lot of questions going on. And my, my question was, will this get will this season get too mystical so that's what that's what i just we want to talk about real quick today yeah. um and that's the question i'm posing to mike and to you guys do you think this season's going to get too mystical and, and and i'll explain a little bit more meaning will it go off the rails because we've had a pretty it's been pretty tight so yeah. far i think these past yeah. two seasons we've been we've we've been growing the world a little bit it hasn't been getting crazy this season looks as if it's gonna where it's gonna expand even more now Mm -hmm. um by letting in these other people it looks like these guys are coming in from outside the badlands into the badlands to to take over to recruit to set up camp it seems like and i'm thinking like i'm looking at this going this looks great but you, you know being a person who watch watches way too much tv <laughs> i'm sitting here going this looks like it might get too like like lost how lost got a little crazy with their mythicality and was like okay hold on your mythology is getting a little muddled i'm just a little worried that it might get a little muddled in that you know now they're gonna cross you know oh well no this gift is from here or this you know yeah. I, 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 what do you think man what do, what do you think listen uh, for the longest time for the for season one and two we've really like you said we've really just been in this one in the in the badlands for the most part yeah we've had you know, we've always heard about Azra. We've heard about, if, you know, if it was even a real place. And now we obviously have some confirmation that it is. Right. I mean, to a degree, these new characters, the Cressida character and, and the Pilgrim character and this Nyx character and stuff. I mean, 100% we can't confirm that they are directly from Azra, I guess. Right, I mean, no, I think they are though. That's the thing. They say it don't in in the trailer. I think they said it. Well, I don't think in the trailer they didn't mention. Or they're going to set up. Actually, you know what? It seems like they might be trying to re-establish Azra. They're trying to get. I think they were trying to get the compass. I think that was it. I think that they were they were coming you see, here. More questions. You know? yeah. I mean, obviously, we have these questions. Obviously, we didn't watch it. We don't know yet. So. Um, yeah, there's still a lot of questions. Listen, at the end of season two, we had the Baji thing where Baji seemed to know exactly what buttons to press on that computer. And, and he sent out that signal, that beam or whatever that was. So listen, I mean, it's not, it's not rocket science to believe that that, that beam and that signal is what caused Pilgrim and everybody to come here. Right. Right. Um, but let's see what happens. I mean, as far as the mystical part, I can kind of get on board that, that um, we might see some things that we haven't seen before, especially with this, um, the, the, the Cressida character, because she seems to be that kind of advisor like for Pilgrim. Like a priestess Pilgrim. or something. Yeah, she yeah. Kinda ha they kind of have that gypsy kind of, yeah. So, I mean, listen, they didn't give us way too much. Um, we, ha we have some pictures, but obviously in the end, it's just some pictures. And basically, it's there to kind of introduce and give us a glimpse of who's new to the show. So, um, I mean, it's, it's kind of up in the air, but... I think that would be sort of interesting. And we talked we talked off camera about how it seemed like this character Nyx, who is is um, a part of the Pilgrim and the Cressida people, uh, the Cressida uh, Cressida uh, Cressida characters, seems to be able to switch on and off that gift. Well, so, well, well, uh, uh, Caster too, the 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 boy. Yeah, the, yeah. The I two mean, they jump up on the trello, they jump up and they're fighting these guys, and she catches the arrow. Like it just seems Sna like yeah, she kind of like snaps it with her fingers and things like that. But that that seemed to be what we 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 never saw in the first two seasons with MK, especially and or even the monks. I mean, the monks did fight yeah. like that. But but here's the other thing though too. Mm. 
not only that, but to me, it looks like, are they, is, is it a worshiping thing? Are they worshiping this gift? Are they, because, so with Cressida, there's a couple shots of her, and again, like, I, I call her a priestess because she's, she's surrounded by this thing, and, and, you know, of course, they can cut it anyway. They want to make it look like someone's talking to someone else, but, yeah, you know what I mean? So, I, I'm not sure where that's going to go as far as, is it, is it, do they worship this power? Do they believe the power comes from a, a being, from a whatever it and that's that's why i'm using the word mystical in in yeah. in that is it going to be that or is it going to be like fanatics are they going to be fanatics to this thing is she going to be that considering she's that you know like you said the advisor to pilgrim and then is pilgrim pulling that and using that to um you know lead the people and gather other people you know what i mean so no, uh, listen uh, if you know, I, I mean, like I said before, we're not 100% sure they're from Azra. I mean, we can kind of tell that they are. And if they are, in fact, we never see in the in the trailer and these images of, of like Cressida or even Pilgrim with, with this gift. We haven't seen him with, the, you know, the black eyes or anything like that. We only see the Knicks. And, right. and you know, of course, we've always seen uh, Sonny in the past and things like that. So there's, you know, there's this gift with that, that, we've, that we've seen. So maybe that is something that it 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 came from from Azra, and then that's why MK is special and things like that. So maybe there is a worshiping part of it. Maybe since Cressida doesn't have it or Pilgrim doesn't have this, that they're worshiping the people or the or oh the people. okay. You know what I mean? Well, obviously, so, this, that, so they see them as special. You think? And yeah, gonna, it's like yeah, it's where yeah, it originated. Okay. You know, it could have originated. They there. tell them you're special, MK. You, you have to join us because you're special and and. Okay, I, I can see that happening. When then you have um, Nix and, and the other dude being like, no, join us because, you know, we're awesome and everyone else sucks and we can kill anyone we want and do whatever we want. But but do you personally feel it may go off the rails and be like, well, now they're getting a little off into the woods with this? Well, listen, I mean, we waited two seasons already to kind of find out that Azra's real. So I'm interested to see and get some more of the history from it. Why exactly Pilgrim Cressida are that, here? That's the other thing. I'm afraid. I'm afraid it it it'll get it'll get caught up in the mysticism of what's going on, you know, and and we won't get any more of the out. Like I I really want to see what like they teased us with the magazine. In the trailer, they go and it looks like into a museum where you see the a, a T Rex skeleton. You know what I mean? So yeah. And they seemed like they were like, oh, you know, well, like we were always interested. Remember when? Remember when there was the fight in um, with MK and everybody, and it was right. like all Christmas decorations, and they had a Wired, an old Wired magazine. Yeah, that's yeah, what I'm saying. Like, I hope they, I hope they expand that, and I hope like Pilgrim or at least Cressida, they're like, I, I don't want them. I just, I, I just don't want it to lose sight. Don't get me wrong. I love this. I love the idea. I love where it's going. Mm -hmm. I mm -hmm. just, I don't. I'm. You know what it is? I, I don't want it to be dragged out. I, I want. Like, give us answers so you can give us more other answers later. So to give us more as to what's happening, as to how far into the future this is. Yeah. You know? well, I, I, Not so much what happened gonna... even, you know? Like, I want to know how, like, give us an idea of how far, like, what, you know what I mean? I believe it was like a few hundred years from, um, you know, like, these times. I believe that's, I think we got that. Did we? Yeah, I think we got that um, that answer before. Um, so, listen, it's to me, it's those kind of things, the things that happened in the past, and the fact that our characters don't really know what happened is very interesting. Um, I think it's interesting that the Badlands is at war. That we really technically only have the Bar uh, the Widow and Chow, and. Um, what's going to happen between them. And we see, you know, we see, uh, uh, the, the widow and we see an old, old friend, Nathaniel moon coming back and stuff like that. So um, no, I wouldn't call him friend so much. Well, our friend, to the <laughs> our channel, friend. Yeah. They gave us a shout out, but it's just, I'm interested to see that. I don't want it to get too crazy. And I think both of us are, we both have that fear that what happens on other AMC series, make that, up this one that's and, real i think yeah that's kind of really what i'm feeling like i i i i, I, don't, I don't think that's gonna happen though with this yeah. i think the shows i think the shows are are a bit too different um i'm a little apprehensive about the fact that the world is getting too large and too expansive to a degree because 
it, in one hand, it can be incredible. We can learn so much more about the world. And like you said, what happened maybe in the past and a, been, and a bit of Azra, where MK came from and knew, you know, his parents and things like that. But on the other side, if they don't do it the right way, it's like, it's like, you know, in walking dead where you introduce a, a community or something that just doesn't make sense. So this show, I'm not fearing that as much, yeah. but of course there's that little bit of me that's saying, ah, oh, let's make sure we do it right. You know what I mean? But I'm excited to, I'm excited to get into this. I think we have another, um, about a month or so, a little less than a, a little month, less than a month yeah. to get into this. And I'm sure we'll get some more trailers and stuff popping in yeah um, but i'm excited dude i'm excited to see if there is that mystic mystical kind of potiony kind of you know i don't know if we'll necessarily get that kind of a thing but just the fact that let's see what this gift is and how this gift works oh yeah you know what i mean cool i mean this i'm i'm look everything i said here it, it, i'm super psyched I seen those images, <laughs> watching the trailer, seeing seeing the action scenes so far, what they, they just, look they, like. You got like snipers, the, <laughs> you've got the, you know, ba Beiji's yeah. obviously fine because they're fighting together. They they meet up. He's trying to get mm -hmm. his son. He said his he says his son is sick. So I'm you know, Nathaniel Moon's back, he has a claw hand, and then he has a new a new like mechanical hand. Like, I'm psyched. Like and that's even gonna be interesting to see how Moon got to that. You know, yeah. after we last saw him in season two. And well, stuff obviously like that, he goes, so. well, obviously, oh, to the claw part or because obviously yeah, he goes yeah, with the yeah, widow just, and she gives him. Yeah. And yeah so, yeah. But, but anyway, it looks, it looks great. I'm, I'm, I'm super psyched to see what's yeah. going on. Like I said, I just, I was just wondering whether they, whether they're going to take it from what we, you know, what, what we, what we can deduce now, but all right. So enough with that. So we love the show. We're so happy for it to come back. We're excited for them that they're doing the show. We're excited for it to be on. Of course. Um, if you guys have any any you know anything to say about this, you know what to do, right, Mikey? What do they do? Of course, write in those comments uh, below the video here on YouTube. Of course, Third Person Pod. We love getting all these uh, comments and questions from you guys. Let us know what you think about uh, the theory about that and how how mystical the show can get, um, and if you like that or not. But of course, check us out on uh, as always at Third Person Pod on Facebook and on Instagram, and don't forget to uh, take a look for us on iTunes as well. Yep, that's it. Guys, Into the Badlands. we got less than a month, so uh, let us know what you guys think, and uh, we'll see you in the next Into the Badlands video. Yes, Until yes. then, peace out. Peace.